The iPhone 6 is a fantastic phone, and there is no denying it. So after three months, is it still fantastic? I waited three hours in line on the 19th of September, 2014, on a Friday night, after school, just to wait for and get the iPhone 6 on launch. So yes, it is a fantastic phone, and I got it for that reason. But there is a couple things that I would like to address after three months, and that is first, the design, the battery, and whatever. Let me just get to it. So I stopped using a case and that is because the design is so good on this phone that I really think it deserves just to be held exactly how it was designed. Um, there is one concern and that is it being very slippery. I do not like having a slippery phone. I have almost dropped it a few times. Never have dropped it. Oh no, I'm gonna drop it now. Um, but I have not dropped it as of this point. I have actually got excellent battery life. Yes, I put my battery percentage at about 20%, but I have been able to get about seven and a half hours of usage, which is stellar. I mean, on my 4S, yes, I always put my battery percent or my uh, brightness level at about 20%, but it was suckish. My the 6, fantastic. The battery is an A+. If you ask me, to wait nine months to get the iPhone 6s, I would say no. Because if Apple does what they're probably gonna do and they're just add subtle little upgrades, then the 6 is perfect. You, why would you wanna wait nine months when basically the same phone is right in front of you and it's out right now when you can go out into the store and purchase it? I don't understand why you would not, but I definitely would go purchase this. The iOS experience after three months is pretty much the same as what I had on the iPhone 4S. Definitely an iOS experience, but definitely something new and fresh that had never been accomplished before. And I'm very glad that Apple took a risk and made the bigger phone because the iPhone has been known for being small. And I know some people were very upset hearing that Apple came out with another phone. Personally, I don't know why, but I'm very glad they came out with two bigger phones. Am I happy with the iPhone 6? Yes, very happy. I don't have any concerns. Yes, there's a few things here and here, um, like a shaky side buttons. That's really annoying. But overall, very, very happy with this phone. And definitely, if you have the ability to purchase one right now, definitely go out to the store right now and go pick one up. And if you are an Android user, I don't know exactly what to tell you. I've never used Android, so if... You are an Android user, go to the store, check it out. You probably, you may not like it. I'm, because I'm an iPhone user, I'm not, I have nothing against Android, but I definitely am more attracted to the iOS platform since I have more, inve or I have more, um, kind of connections, not connections, uh, more investments in the iPhone ecosystem. So if you're an iPhone user who is looking for an upgrade, even if you have an iPhone 4S, definitely go out and pick this up. I do not think you will regret it. Alright guys, this has been Renenko, and I will catch you later.